Strictly Come Dancing's Nadia Bichkova, 33, was thrilled to be reunited with her Ukrainian family after a difficult journey across from the war-torn country. The Ukrainian dancer has previously spoken about Russia's invasion of Ukraine and the effects it has had on her family, as earlier this year she was desperately trying to get her grandmother to safety. In a new series of snaps, the BBC star can be seen beaming as she and her daughter are reunited with her grandmother, mother and father. Taking to Instagram, Nadia shared the sweet pictures taken in Dubai, United Arab Emirates, in view of her 168,000 followers. What a trip, she began in the caption with a heart emoji. I can't put it into words how special this week was. Kate Silverton says it feels good to speak out away from BBC impartiality rule something I wished for such a long time finally came true. Family reunion. This never happened before. Nadia went on to reveal that it had been nearly seven years since she had last seen her father, while her daughter Mila had never got to meet him in person. She continued, I finally saw my dad after almost seven years. And Mila met her grandfather for the first time in person. She also described the difficult journey that her grandmother had made to reach them, as Ukraine continues to fight back against ongoing attacks from Russia. Don't miss! Jeremy Clarkson laments end-of-office romances after Philip Schofield scandal, news, Jane McDonald breaks silence as her TV replacement is announced, insight, Amanda Holden flashes underwear as BGT star almost spills out of sheer dress, latest, my grandmother managed her way from Ukraine probably the most difficult trip in her life, she added. I had my family in one place. All of us. Together, heart emoji. What a week I will never forget it. Family is everything. I am so grateful that I managed to organize it all and that everything worked out, she concluded with heart and prayer emojis. Sick, back in April, Nadia opened up about the struggle of trying to get her grandmother out of Ukraine in an interview with GB News. She said of her grandmother, it is very difficult. In the part of Ukraine she is in, the war started long ago in 2014. So, in the worst possible way we kind of got used to it. My mum's traveling more often to see my grandmother and to make sure she's okay. But it's just really hard. She added, I'm trying to get my grandmother here but it's difficult as she's older and she's like well that is my home, I don't want to leave. But at the same time I'm so worried if anything happens. There's not much I can do straight away because it'll take me three days to get there. Melting